Hello students, today we will solve question from your mathematics book given at page number 37, exercise 2.3, question number 10. Find the sum of greatest 2 digits, 3 digits and 4 digits numbers. We will solve this question with help of currency notes. Greatest 4 digits number is 9999. Now we will count currency notes. Here we have 9 notes of 1 rupees which means 9 at 1's place. Next we will count 10 rupee notes. Here we have 10, uh, 90 rupees which means 9 at 10's place. Next we will count 100 rupee notes. Here we have 900 rupees which means 9 at 100's place. Next we will count 1000 rupees notes. Here we have 9000 rupees. So which means 9 at 1000's place. Greatest 3 digit number which is 999. Now we will count currency notes. First 1 rupees notes, here we have 9 rupees which means 9 at 1's place. Next 10 rupees notes, here we have 90 rupees which means 9 at 10's place. Here we have 900 rupees which means 9 at 100's place. Test 2 digits number which is 99. Currency notes here we have 9 rupees which means 9 at 1's place. Now 10 rupees notes here we have 90 rupees which means 9 at 10's place. Now we will see how many currency notes we have. First of all we will count 1 rupees notes. So let us start. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. So here we have 27 rupees which means 27 ones. So we know that 10 ones are equal to 1 tens. So 20 ones will be equal to 2 tens. So instead of taking 20 notes of rupees 1, we will change this with 2 notes of rupees 10. Here we have 7 rupees which means 7 at 1's place and this we have 2 notes of 10 rupees which means 20 rupees and 2 will be placed at 10's place. Now we will count 10 rupees notes. So here we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190 and 200, 210, 200. 20, 230, 240, 250, 260, 270, 280 and 290. So here we have 290 rupees which means 29 tens. We know that 10 tens are equal to 100. So 20 tens will be equal to 200. So we will change these 20 notes of rupees 10 with 2 notes of rupees 100. So now we have 90 rupees which means 9 tens. So 9 will be at tens 
place. Here we have two notes of rupees hundred. So here we will place two at hundreds place. Count hundred rupees notes. So here we have one hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, nine hundred, and one thousand. Here we have one thousand one hundred. One thousand two hundred, one thousand three hundred, one thousand four hundred, one thousand five hundred, one thousand six hundred, one thousand seven hundred, one thousand eight hundred, one thousand nine hundred, and two thousand. Which means here we have twenty hundreds. So we know that ten hundreds are equal to one thousand. So twenty hundreds will be equal to. Two thousands. So we will change these twenty notes of rupees hundred with two notes of rupees thousand. So here at hundreds place we have nothing. So we will place zero at hundreds place and two at thousands place. Thousand rupees notes. So here we have one thousand, two thousand. Three thousand, four thousand, five thousand, six thousand, seven thousand, eight thousand, nine thousand, ten thousand, and eleven thousand. Instead of taking ten notes of rupees thousand, we will take one notes of rupees ten thousand. So here we have one note that is thousand at. Thousands place. So here we will place one at thousands place and one at ten thousands place. Now, if we count notes at ten thousands place, we have only one note, which means we will place one at ten thousands place. We have total rupees that is eleven thousand ninety. Seven sum of greatest four digit number, greatest three digit number, and greatest two digits number is eleven thousand and ninety seven. Hope you have understood question number ten. Now for your homework, you will solve question number nine and ten in your notebooks. Thank you.